Riverbed provides dramatic acceleration of key applications such as Windows file sharing and Microsoft SharePoint. To demonstrate this, I have a typical scenario with a client on one side of the network and both the Windows file server and SharePoint server located in the data center over a wide area network connection of 500 kilobits per second, 100 milliseconds of round trip time latency. For the purpose of comparison, I have two network paths, one that is being optimized by Riverbed Sealed Appliances and a path that is not being optimized. Looking at my Windows desktop, I have a folder at the bottom of the screen that is going to my local C drive. There is a file share on the upper left that is not going through Steelhead Appliances and a file share on the upper right that is being optimized by Steelhead Appliances. The first thing that I'll do is copy a 3.2 megabyte PowerPoint file to the unoptimized share. Now over this 500 kilobits per second, 100 millisecond round trip time link, this process is slow and painful. What takes a couple seconds on the LAN takes in excess of two minutes over this wide area network connection. Now what's happening on the background is several thousands of round trips taking place just to complete the simple operation, with each round trip incurring the penalty of that round trip time. So once again, what takes just a couple seconds on a LAN is very slow. So let's cancel that operation. Now let's try the same operation on the file share that is being optimized by Steelhead Appliances. This PowerPoint presentation represents data that has never been seen by these Steelhead Appliances. Now Steelhead Appliances can optimize data that has never been seen before by applying on-the-fly LZ compression combined with first level layer 7 acceleration. So what took an excess of two minutes to complete without optimization now takes less than what's going to be about 45 seconds to complete the first time the data has been seen. Now that we have this data copied to the centralized file server, let's go ahead and delete the local copy and see how long it takes to fetch this data from the optimized share now that we've consolidated everything. Now let's go ahead and take that file uh, from the optimized share. Again, three megabytes over this high latency, 500 kilobit per second connection going through the Stillhead Appliances, and I didn't see an hourglass, did you? It was uh, essentially instantaneous. So what started out as two minutes reduced to 45 seconds the first time to basically instantaneously the second time. Now, the Stillhead Appliance optimizations go beyond simply copying the data. Let's look at a typical enterprise workflow where we're going to go ahead and open up this PowerPoint presentation, make a simple change here. I'm going to change, uh, insert a slide, uh, insert a title, and uh, what I'm going to go ahead and do is, um, after doing this, making a you know, just a couple byte change, let's go ahead and save this as a new file name, and let's call it uh, add version 2 to the uh, file name. And then from here, I'm going to go ahead and uh, save this document. We have an updated document should just show a, a couple bytes that have changed. Now let's take this updated document and copy it through our optimized share and see if it takes over two minutes because it may look like a new document. But no, what happens is the Steelhead appliances work together, identify that only a couple bytes have changed, and only ch send the bytes that have changed in addition to applying layer seven acceleration. That demonstrated the Steelhead appliances ability to accelerate Windows file sharing environments. Let's shift gears and see what Steelhead Appliances can do for Microsoft SharePoint. Now instead of file shares this time, we have SharePoint repositories. The one on the left is not being optimized, and the one on the right is being optimized by Riverbed Steelhead Appliances. Now the first thing I'd like to do is take that same 3 megabyte PowerPoint presentation that we used in the Windows file sharing demo and try to access it with SharePoint. So let's go ahead and take this and copy it to the desktop. And what you see is on the LAN, it would take only a couple of seconds to download this file. But once again, over this 500 kilobits per second, 100 milliseconds of round trip time latency connection, this operation takes significantly longer than just a couple of seconds. And this is some of the inefficiencies in the protocol and the application that's uh, driving this operation. So let's go ahead and cancel that operation and try it through the Riverbed Steelhead appliances. So take that same file, save target as, and let's go ahead and save that to the desktop, and boom, it's uh, essentially instantaneous, just like we saw on SIFS.
So at this time, you might be asking the question, why is it so fast with SharePoint on the first pass? Now, the answer is that the Steelhead Appliance has already recognized the data patterns of the PowerPoint file, regardless of what protocol or application was used to do the transfer. You know, as a result, no new bytes had to be delivered over the wider network, and we got LAN-like performance over the WAN. Thank <laughs> you.